Using the Splicecom SV1000 admin portal, this video will show you how to program basic call routing parameters to include a new hunt group with members, to find a new department with routing to the new hunt group, and finally to configure a direct dial in number to route to the department thus causing the users in the new hunt group to ring. To start, select the department tab. You will see two options, groups and manage departments. Click on groups. Then click on select a group. Here you can program a default group, for example group 10 has no name associated or you can add a new group. Let's add a new group by selecting from the list create new group. Enter a name, in this example demo group. Next select the users you wish to be part of the group. To remove simply select the user again. You will see the user become blue when selected and a list of group members are shown on the bottom right. That's the new group demo group added, so let's return to the home screen and program the department which the group will be part of. Select departments and this time manage departments. If you have default departments available such as 8008, you can edit this by highlighting the department and selecting edit or add a new department by selecting add. Let's add a new department. By entering a department name, this is the name or brand users will see when a call is presented. You can choose the number or retain the next offered. Then provide a description if required. Select out of hours mode, for example times, therefore allowing the department to follow its in or out of hours routing plan based upon the time of day. Select the time plan. In this instance, we will choose the standard time plan. However, you can add others. No, adding time plans can be configured under the plans tab on the home page. Next, select the distribution tab. Select the send inbound calls and select demo group from the drop down list. Next, choose the ring type. For example, all devices to ring either all at once or calls can route between users in a rotary or sequential ring pattern. Let's select all. Skip if users busy allows the call to bypass the demo group if all users are either busy on calls, logged out or on DND. Additionally, you can apply a ring timer. The calls will ring the demo hunt group for the period set if users are available before moving on to a further group if set. Let's apply some settings. Skip is on. Time is set to wait for 25 seconds at the demo group. If not answered, we will route calls to another group. We can then save the changes and click OK. Now we will route a DDI to the department. Select Routing and then the DDI Routing option. Click Add to add a DDI. Enter the number match. In the Translate to, select Department and then select our new demonstration department. When a call is made to the entered DDI, the demonstration department name will be displayed. The calls will ring the demo group and overflow to reception if not answered, displaying the name demonstration department upon ring. This concludes our call routing video.